new national campaign is helping those with autism this Halloween. Good evening. I'm Katie Orth. Eddie Flores has the night off. Big Two's Felice Romero sat down with a special education specialist to talk about a new way to make kids with autism feel included while trick-or-treating. She joins us now in the studio with more. Felice. That's right, Katie. Lindsay Balderas tells Big Two that with all the costumes, lights, and interaction, it can be a bit of a sensory overload for children with autism. She hopes this new trend will make Halloween fun for everyone. The blue jack-o'-lantern signifies an individual with autism. Autism really impacts um, as an individual's ability to communicate and their social skills. For many, free candy is the best part about Halloween. But for autistic children, Halloween can be stressful and draining. Trick-or-treating requires a lot of social interaction. It may be misread by people who are unaware that um, a child is being rude or disrespectful if they don't communicate. Having that blue jack-o'-lantern uh, kind of alerts the person that this child just needs a little bit more support. Lindsay Baldera says it's important that every kid feels included and enjoys the holidays. Autism impacts 1 in 59 children. That's the most recent um, report by the CDC. It's really important that we have these little social cues for ourselves so that we'll know how to interact with these um, children and help uh, build a better society, uh, build a more engaging and exciting uh, time for them, especially during these holidays. According to the special education assistant professor, these blue jack-o'-lanterns also help the parents. They feel um, a lot of stress going into public situations because they're worried about a meltdown or behavioral issues and the way that people will look at them. If we can be more supportive, more understanding, more aware, then we can reduce some of that stress for the parents and the family members. Valdera says while not every autistic child is the same, just the act of patience can help a child who may be feeling overwhelmed and maybe even help them have a positive trick-or-treating experience. Live in studio, Feliz Romero, Big Two News.